everyone, I am the Dragon Skull, and welcome back to The Walking Dead, A New Frontier. Uh, where we left off, um, we began episode 3, and it started off with yet another flashback of when um, Harvey, Kate, Gabe, and Mariana um, left the house. And um, then they flash forward back to the present when um, we found David again, and he explained to us how he became part of The New Frontier. And it turns out he's not the leader, but he's only, but he's one of the leaders. There are actually four leaders in charge of, of the New Frontier. And I have to, um, make peace with the other ones in order to, for us to let us in. But I'm not sure about staying, though. I'm not sure about be staying with the New Frontier. Uh, we also told David the truth about what happened to Mariana, and he was killed by one of his men named Badger. Yeah. And, um, Kate... She doesn't want to be, be part of David's life anymore. She wants to, like, be with me back all, out on the road traveling. And I don't know if I want to do that because, well, I don't want to abandon David. I like David. Also, we haven't seen Clementine at all. We haven't seen her in the, fir in the first episode I did uh, of episode three. Uh, but hopefully she might appear in this episode. I really hope she appears again. And I want Clementine to appear. I love Clementine. But anyway, we are now about to meet the other two leaders of the new frontier. So let's just get let's get this over with. Huh, we're in a church. Nice place. Always wonder, what does that symbol it may actually look, look pretty, like? But it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint Hello? Owns food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. Well, I hope you haven't been handled so. too roughly. Nice to meet Some you at last. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> no complaints here. I get that you guys have a way of doing things. Thank you. We have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. They seem like nice people. We were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no oh. contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi, there. take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. The cake. Definitely spinach the cake. Clint's garden I love cake. Or a baked delicacy by Yeah, definitely you. cake. I'd have to go with that cake. Spinach I haven't seen is anything disgusting. like that in years. <sighs> Suit yourself. Come on, Clint. At least he's being honest. You can't get stuff like that in the apocalypse Please, anymore. Please, make yourself comfortable. I'd love to have that cake. Mine is the cherries, we but it still looks good. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here so yeah people who choose to stay with us they have to deal with us bossing them around not saying you wouldn't but it can be an adjustment especially for the more independent minded there's no structure out there now i can people adjust get used to doing as they please i always do what i'm told I ask my older brother you're gonna <laughs> fit in well hobby i can see that already thanks when joan and i met your brother he was trying his hand at fruit fruit we found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring <laughs> it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Oh. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is What does it about? actually mean? What does it look like? It's our litmus test for loyalty. That looks pretty intense. Doesn't it hurt? It's burned into your flesh. Of course it fucking hurts. It's a sign yeah. of commitment, not a Buddhist symbol from your year abroad. It was Point a crude taken. answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. Um, I know it's a I lot I know how you ask, feel, really. But I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. 
I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer. It's a terrible feeling. I just yep. want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Amen to that. Oh, it's him. It's Max. Max. What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Well, kind of. can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Han. Well, we're not really friends. Let's so. just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, <laughs> because I just said you wouldn't be invited. <laughs> Max, but, how did this start? He's okay. It's not him I hate. It's Badger him. I hate. You have an obligation to tell the truth. Oh god, this is gonna end badly, isn't it? We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? I didn't know it was yours. Yeah, I didn't know it was Answer. your gas. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. You just asked. We'd have given it to you. Yeah, I call BS on that. Because I pretty much did ask that, and you That's not all. And you assume Rufus those said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? The girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that Leave girl. Leave Clementine alone. Yeah. She's my girl. I would say not. Clementine's not a bad person, at least from what I've seen. Of course you'd say that. You got that honor among thieves. Shut this up. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. I'm not the bad guy here. The badger something is. resembling civilization. You think I'm bad? You have maniacs running around out there who are much, much worse. I'm not sure what you mean. We hold our people to the highest standards. Javi? You have something to say? Oh, I promise, David, I, I keep it to myself. No, I, I'm, I'm not gonna no. say anything. That's it. I promise That's David. Right. He knows what he done. There ain't nothing more to say. Uh, Shut up. It's clear your brother doesn't belong here. Javi and his people have to go. You're overreacting. It was a scuffle over supplies. <laughs> We've exiled people for less. Sorry, David. Your soldiers are already wild enough. We can't add more crazy to the mix. Take Javi and everyone in quarantine to the gate. Give them a pack with a bare minimum to survive. Screw you. I knew I, did, I knew I could trust these guys. I knew that I didn't like them. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. Do something, David. You're the leader too, this aren't you? This is ridiculous. You? you have to do something. I, I can't right now. But maybe I can down the road. Just At least stay try alive. To... Okay. At least try to, to convince them. Well, at least David's not gonna be the evil one here. Instead, it's the other leaders. Maybe not the Doctor, but those two, yes. I can't believe this. They're gonna kick us out now. Well, everyone except Kate and Gabe and um, El Eleanor. Just because I'm friends with Clementine. Well, screw you. I love Clementine. If I had to choose between this and Clementine, I would choose Clementine. You're lucky I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? Poor Tripper's talking to me for a minute. Hey there, Megasonic. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on. David packed this. He did. They said. Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Whoa! Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. Easy trip. God damn it, Harvey! Let You're not me. This isn't gonna help Eleanor. Don't make it worse for her. Yeah. Listen to me, trip. Whoa! Jesus Christ, she is strong. Fuck this up. Damn, she's strong. She really is Negasonic Teenage There's Warhead. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. 
Don't come back. All right. Note to self, guys. Do not piss her off. She's different than the first time I've seen her as Clementine. You alright, Trip? Go ahead, give me a hand. Jeez, Trip is pissed off at me now. Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. I was. We trusted you. It didn't go as planned. Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well. I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Yeah. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. <laughs> Alright, let's see what they've got. In let's see what's in this duffel bag. Hey, a baseball bat. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? Because Harvey David's used to be a baseball player. Was always poorly timed. Yeah, David used to be a baseball player before all this happened. David remembered. Oh. Okay. There's Richmond. That Harvey, helps. I meant to say, used to be a but baseball player. We can't go player. back there. Knowing where it is lets us know where we are. Okay. Um. Looks like they're expanding. It's a bit dark. Can't Some see Some of these areas well. are marked clear. They're expanding. Well, except for this area, the this I'm pretty here. sure David wants us to go there. And Looks that way. Here, and I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. And to find north, we need to find the North Star. <laughs> right on, Jesus. And it's this one here. That's it. We need to go this way. Did you put what that star there, Jesus? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. That sucks. <laughs> of course Jesus Let's gets go. the axe. Or I guess we're not welcome here. Trip, come on. What's up? I can't lose anyone else. I'm telling you, I can't. You won't. Prescott, Conrad, maybe Eleanor. I won't much. let that happen. You won't lose anyone else. I won't let that happen. I'm gonna hold you to that, Hobby. I promise Sorry, we'll get her out. Rough day, to say the least. I know you got my back. And I got yours. Of course. After you. Thanks. So much for the new frontier. They just kicked us out. And David doesn't have anything to do about it. Because it's not in his power. <sighs> David's okay, but the other leaders are, um, not so nice. Oh, Buddy Rabbit! Where's Clementine? I want to see Clementine! I hope she shows up in this episode. I, I really hope she you, does. Man. I thought you and Kate were, you know. Well, we kind of were, but I, that was because I didn't think. I, I thought David was dead. I saw you kiss her in the junkyard. And yeah. I ain't judging, mind you. I'm just curious. What's the story? I thought David was dead. So ain't and my business, I know. Kate was coming on to me. What have we got to lose out here? Yeah, I do have feelings for her. I'll I admit mean, it. Hey, man. It's all right. Go for it. I do have feelings for her. And maybe I shouldn't, but that doesn't just make him go away. Uh, no harm in saying it. Hell, only real harms in not saying it when you should. Hmm. It's True always enough. a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. If they're one and the same or otherwise, you know what I mean? Well, love it's is worth it. Think you got everything figured out. Boom. Heart goes ass over tea kettle. No, if it wasn't messy, it wouldn't be important, right? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Just saying, man. Three things that never hide forever. The sun, the moon, and the truth. <laughs> Eleanor and I, we were... Some you were point, close, weren't you? At some point. But nothing now. I respect her wishes. I really do. You'll get her. <laughs> just wish my heart respected mine. 
Shep should be a poet. Yeah, he, he'd be a really good poet. You're gonna say roses are red, violets are blue to her? Maybe he's got his eye on Satan. <laughs> what you got for us, man? Listen. Well, Tell me that isn't what I think it is. Yep, About it is. Mile out, heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. Satan just stupid. replied to Jesus by sending his his army of the dead. That sounds good. Walkers. Okay, book alive, people. I got him. Whoa! That was awesome! Go, Jesus! Get him! Yep. Never mess with Jesus in the zombie apocalypse. Nice one. Yeah, I can see the brain. Oh, you want some? Batter up! <laughs> You're up next. Oh, it's Hannibal Lecter! <laughs> That's what I just said. I just killed Hannibal Lecter. More walkers. Want a piece of this? Come on, bring it! I can take you! <laughs> I think Harvey's being a bit too cocky now. Oh, jeez. Get away! Get off! Get off me! Oh, jeez. Uh, guys, a little help here, please! I can't take a book by myself! Oh wait, never mind, I can! No, I, I can't, I can't, I need help! Guys, help me out! Jesus! Jesus, help me already! I'd like an ex machina, please! Can an ex machina appear and save me? Yeah! It's gone! Clementine ex machina! Yes, finally, Clem's back! You should be more careful with this. Oh, I've missed you. Please don't ever leave me again, Clem. Please stay with me. We're even now. <laughs> yep. Wait, even for what? Anna, it, who cares? I, I thought you were getting out of here. I was. But the walkers are everywhere. I had to cover myself in walker guts to get away. Come on. We're heading to a factory nearby. Should be safe. I thought you were going to Richmond. New well, Frontier kick you out? Yeah, you could say that. Me. Not one bit. Well, not everyone did. Not all of us. Kate and Gabe are still there. With David. David? That asshole's still around? What? This is gonna sound really weird, but... He's my brother. What? Yep, surprise! <laughs> Wait, this place we're going... David sent you there? I'm guessing she and David have a history together. To Clem. Yeah, Clem and you David might have a history. Trust him, Harvey. Why not? He's my I brother. That the hard way. What did he do to you, Clem? What did David do to you? I never wanted to need people again. But I had nowhere else to go. The New Frontier gave me this and made me one of them. They promised they'd help him. AJ! That turned out to be a lie. What did they do to AJ? Don't tell me they killed them! Not AJ! No, please tell me he's not dead. My heart can't take it if AJ, a baby, is dead. Someone Clementine raised, the same way I raised her. Oh, we're in another flashback. Medicine you need, AJ. Oh, AJ sick. So AJ sick. It's been a long time since I've played as Clementine. A really long time. So AJ sick and have to steal medicine. And I'm guessing they find out and she gets kicked out. Oh, someone's there. <laughs> oh, it's the doctor, Doctor Lingard. No, 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 no. AJ, shh, 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 uh, pump to him, pump to him, like we did before. AJ, shh. There you go. Aww. Just like that little guy. Next time um, he starts crying, I have to hum to him all the time. That's what um, comes him down. Aww, AJ's so cute. I just want to pinch his little cheeks. 
Van Com... I don't know how to pronounce that. Alright, uh... Take Needle? Oh god, that to inject AJ with something. I hope not. I'm guessing I do. Uh, is this it? Okay, uh, this one. Pills. Alright, then it's definitely this one right here. Here it is. Yep, this is it. What even is it? <sighs> what? What's wrong, Clem? I, I don't know how to say that. I have to inject AJ with that, don't I? Oh, this is gonna hurt. You're better. Not gonna lie to you though, AJ. It is gonna sting. It is gonna sting quite a little bit. Oh god, he's gonna start crying again after I inject him with this. Uh oh, he's waking Clem. up. Dr. Lingard, what's the matter with you? Um, I'm fine. Um, Clem, I'm, please don't. I'm not the feeling. Vancomycin. That's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. I told you. It could save someone's life if used right. It's our only chance, it's though. It's too valuable to throw away. It's the only thing that can save him. Except it can't. I'm oh. sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I... I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. How do you know? Clem the drugs back before anyone finds out you took them um what do I do you know what they do to thieves um here. I don't know uh there's still time uh, risk it risk it I have to try I'm gonna risk it I need to save AJ I don't want him to die um look look over there AJ hey, look AJ a bunny rabbit yeah don't look at your arm okay I'm not it's only gonna sting for a little bit okay be brave, AJ. Be brave. <laughs> AJ! What the hell is this? Oh. I told her it was a bad idea. Hey. Hey, guys. You fucking high again? He's on drugs? Get yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. How could you be so stupid? Well, so selfish? What else could I do? I had nothing left to lose. AJ was gonna die if I didn't. He's gonna die anyway. That waste? That'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough! We should have left him out in the woods a week ago! But look! It's helping! It doesn't work that way, Clown. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. I wish I could tell you it would save him, but that's the. I'm reality. sorry. I'm sorry. I thought there was a chance. At least he's not suffering. You think yeah. that's worth the cost? We opened yes. our arms to you, made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. You broke our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. It's about There's survival, There's no place for David. you in the new frontier. You've made that pretty damn obvious. This was about his survival. So don't you dare judge me. It's always about survival. We have a better chance of it with you gone. Maybe we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Who are you, David? We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. What? No! Can't take him with you. You're not taking AJ! Say. I'm not leaving without him. AJ can't travel. All we can do now is make him comfortable. I'm not leaving without him. Let him go, Clem. No! He'll only drag you down out there. It's what's best for both of you. Screw you. No! No! AJ! You monsters! They just took him away! What about this? What was it all for? Don't forget, I'm one of you. Not anymore. Why, David? Just why? Let her say goodbye. 
We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Oh, so I don't want to. Then you go. I don't want to. Please don't make me regret this. Let's just do it. I'm not gonna spin this face. I'd have, I'd be an idiot if I did that. Goodbye, AJ. I love you, goofball. I don't want to leave him. I don't want to leave AJ. Come on, Clem. At least he doesn't die. He doesn't die, right? AJ, I don't want to leave him. Oh, oh, AJ! Oh, the hurt. The hurt, the hit that struck me in the heart. Oh my god. Oh. Shots fired indeed. Oh, my heart. That hit me right in the heart. I AJ would be the one. Finally. That was so cute. The one, one. The one who didn't die. Oh. Hug Clem. Of course I'm gonna hug Clem. Come here, Clem, bring it in. Hog, just like we used to as Lee. Come on, bring it in. My little goofball. I'll always love you, Clem. That's what I get for trusting other people. Again. Don't worry, Clem. I'm here for you. I always will. And nothing will change that. I can't believe David took AJ away from her. This is what David circled on the map. Our smelly friends are back. Ugh. Let's take him out. Go, Clem! Nice one. Fire up! Yeah! Come on, get it! Okay, close the door. A little help would be nice, thank you. Jesus, that was close. Oh, it's not gonna hold though. Oh, jeez. Then to push against this, it might give. Gotta find a way in. Okay, I need to get inside very fast. Lift the door, lift the door, quickly. Hurry, hurry, come on, get the coming. Come on, use your strength. Come on, you've got this. They come. I can... Come on. Fuck. I can raise it a little, but I don't know, something's wrong with it. Damn Jammed it. Or some shit. Maybe we can force it open. We're oh. gonna have to. They could help me, but if they did, there would be no one up against the fence. Okay, what the. Oh, door, door. I don't hear anything in there. Good enough for me. I meant to open it, not oh, listen. Man. This thing ain't as strong as we thought. Hurry it up. I'm going as fast as I can, Trip. I'm going as fast as I can. Look for another way in. It's our only chance. I'm trying, Jesus. A miracle would be nice right now, Jesus. Jesus, now would be a good time to perform a miracle. No wheels. Oh, God, Jack. Oh, shit. Jesus. Damn it. Oh, the handle's in there. All right, I need to get it. Come out, Walker. Batter up, and it's a home run. Okay, quickly, grab it, grab it. Okay, come on, come on, hurry, hurry. Take it again. Okay, I got it. Quick, 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 open the door, open the door. Quick, 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 hurry. It's not holding. Nice one, Jesus. Get that door open. I'm going as fast as I can. Come on, come on, come on. That's it. Won't go any higher. Everyone get in. Go on, get in quickly. Go, go, go. Come on, Jesus. Come on, Trip. Get in, Trip. Trip, let's go. Did they make it? Did Trip make it? Please say Trip made it. I don't want to see anyone else die. Is he gonna make it? Get in, Trip. Come on, Trip. Close the door. Hurry. Right. Get that goddamn Jack out of there. Okay, hang on. Okay, kick it out. 
Come on, Vulcan King! Vulcan King, the, the, the head on his thing! <sighs> Damn! Sorry guys, but I'm going to end this episode right here now. <laughs> yeah. It's gone way past half an hour now, so I need to stop here. Things are getting intense now. Boy. Hey, But I'm happy now that Clementine has finally returned. And we also found out that she and David have a history together. We also found out what happened to AJ in the end. They took him away from Clementine. I was afraid that they they would kill him or something, but they didn't. AJ might still be alive. He we he could be in Richmond right now. So maybe um later we might do a rescue mission to get AJ back. I hope so, that is. Uh, is David really the bad guy though? I really don't want to believe that that David is the villain because if that is true, then that means the theory I came up with in the beginning might be true. That in the maybe in episode five there might be a one final difficult decision where I have to choose between Clementine and David. Oh God, I hope I really hope a situation like that doesn't come because I don't think I'll be able to handle a decision like that. I have to choose between family and who Harvey's family and Clementine, who is pretty much my family, and all the people who played this game, because. We've we've raised Clementine ever since the the first season, and we've been with her ever since. I don't want I don't want to see Clementine die. If if she dies, I'm going to lose my mind. I probably won't be human anymore after this, because Clementine means so much, and I would probably hate Telltale for for doing this. I really hope this decision doesn't come. Maybe if I'm lucky, David and Clementine can make up and. And David's not the villain, but it's the other leaders. I hope that's the case. Hope we'll find out soon. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I will see you all next time. Peace.